And please get the leaf and petal plant food. I swear by this stuff. I do too. I use it on every flower that I have outside. To think about how much mess I made in the past, and now it's so funny? easy. The only plant that I have that I that I don't no longer have was I, for, I forgot which one it was. I think it was a gardenia that mm -hmm. I had because I went on vacation and I left mm -hmm. it for nine days by yeah, itself. Yeah, no. And it didn't get water, and I was like, ah. Oh. But every other plant I have is thriving. Four hundred left. Four hundred left. If you want to buy it, man, Rosie. Oh, I love being best. here Come with you. Here. You're the best. We're the best. <laughs> All right, if you have any other questions for us, you can always check it out on hsn.com. A lot of the explanations are right there. Rosie will be back in a couple of weeks or yeah. next week. Maybe I think next, next week. week. Next week. Yeah, yeah. I'm not here. Okay. I'm on vacation next week. Fun. I think Ty will be here. Emily will fun. be here. Fun. Have a fun vacation. All right, that's it for hour number one. Where are we going, Sam? Oh, we're going to go back to the mailbox. Okay. Thank you, Rosie. Thank you. Hey, yes. You've got mail. All right. Mm. Let me have a little sip of tea. All right, so we asked the question of the day, which is, we, we found out the groundhog uh, came, and so we don't have, it's gonna come early, spring's gonna come early. You know what I'm talking about, didn't see a shadow, all that stuff. So our question of the day is, what about winter are you ready to say goodbye to, right? What are you ready to get rid of? Ooh, we got lots of, we got Anita, my girl Anita. Uh, what don't I like about winter up here? She says, I don't like it because I can't be outside digging and getting dirty without freezing. Good one, Anita. Shady says the worst part about winter is losing power. She said it happened twice to them last month. Burr, hashtag giveaway. Cheryl, hi Cheryl. I don't think I said hi to Cheryl. She says I love snow, but my least favorite thing about winter is ice. Storms and driving in the snow. Nobody likes to do that. Snow is beautiful when you're home by the fire with hot chocolate, but it's tough to drive in. All right. Those are three of our possibilities for our $25 gift card. We will give you our answer a little bit later. Um, all right, let me move to my second hour. Let me switch all my cards around. Um, I said hi to my Facebook friends, so I'm glad you're all joining me today. Sam, will you keep me posted on the Jasmine? I want to order that when I get off air. How many do I have left? Sam's going to tell me. Okay. So I got a couple, I got a couple of promos that I want to talk about. I own this. I see it. Thanks, Rebecca. I see it. I own this, and I will tell you, love it, okay? This is not a pressure washer. This is what we call a power sprayer. So this is going to amp up. You know, your regular garden hose is about 60 PSI. This is going to amp it up about five or six times with a six-nozzle sprayer. I think it's six. It might be five. But you get all these different sprayers, and it comes with a car wash brush that you can attach. So what do I love about it? All you do is hook it up to your garden hose. And now you've got a power sprayer to clean garden tools, to, to water plants, to clean your SUVs, your RVs, your ATVs, whatever it is, your bikes. You can, heck, you can water your garden with this. So the reason I made it my pick, I paid, I didn't pay $99.95, I get a company discount. I paid about $60 for it, okay, on my discount. You're getting it cheaper than me. And it comes with the battery. There's no battery extra. $49.95, and guess what else you can do? You can drop the siphon, which comes with it, in a five gallon bucket of water, and you, you could use it there. You could put it in your pool and wash off the deck. You don't have to connect a garden hose. Half price today, I expect that to, sell out as well. Sam, keep me posted on that one too, all right, as far as quantity. $49.95, coolest thing ever. All right, come on back over. You know, we launched our, our beautiful shimmering chandeliers, has to be five years ago, all right? And how, how many years have we done the garden show now? We're in like year, how many years have we done the garden show now? Lindsay, it's five years, right? So we offer all kinds of things. I think I'm gonna step over here, Rebecca, so I can get on this side of it. These have been one of our most popular items. And what it's called, it's, it's basically called our jeweled chandelier. So this is an, uh, basically an outdoor feature. You can have it indoors as well. Um, but it's got LED beautiful lights built in, OK? It's, it's adorned with these gorgeous acrylic jewels. It's mostly five-star reviews on hsn.com. And I'll kind of give it a little movement here so you can see how they move in the breeze. I love this anywhere you want it, covered patio. It could be outside, it could be indoors, it's beautiful. Look at what we did with the price, because this is a closeout. Once these are gone, we're not gonna have this model anymore. We dropped the price from $42.95 down to 24. Chad, we're giving this away. I didn't know that. 
We are giving this away at $24.95. I think it's romantic. I think it's elegant. It's durable. And it's completely put together when you take it out of the package. Chad Allen is going to rejoin me after the success of our flicker flame. <laughs> How cool are those flicker flame lights? I love those flicker those flame Those are my lights. absolute favorite lights. Those are my favorite. These, this is beautiful for, if you have like yep. an outdoor sitting area. Yep. Or if you just want to make, you know, you just want to make a beautiful area inside your home, you can do that as well. Yes. Because this is not solar. No. Battery operated, and we give you the batteries. And we give you the batteries. Yeah. So this can go indoors or out, even in a little girl's room, yes. right, who wants something special and illuminated. So tell us what it is and how it works. Well, little girl's room, Valerie Stuff, our host here, yeah. she has one in her closet. Perfect. Because what it does is it elevates, and I'm going to sort of put it in front of me maybe, it's clear, which matches any decor. It's about two feet long. It's 22 and some change long, right? Yep. And uh, almost nine inches in diameter. And the very top of it is what makes this different than probably anything else you've seen. It's a two-tier construction. So there's two steel rings here with springs that line those steel rings. Why? Because these little jeweled crystals are on an O-ring and they would slide around if they weren't, right? So if I tipped this over, those jewels would all fall to one side. But because of those springs and the way it's designed, they stay in place, which is great because it comes to you fully assembled. It's gonna come flat packed, you open it up, they fall right where you need to go. Now, if we stay on that shot there, this is so great because this little twist top lid here, this battery pack, no little screws, no little screwdriver needed. We give you the three AAA batteries. They're included in your box. They're separated, so you do have to open them up out of a little plastic, pop them in here, and then you flip that, that little black switch. You flip that switch one time. You never touch it again. Why? Because it has a smart timer built in that lasts for four hours. So it's going to go on for four hours. Oh, and by the way, we give you all the chain. We even give you what I'm hanging on here in my hand, like the little ring to hang on a nail or a hook. Okay, so when you flip that switch the first time, it stays on for four hours, goes off for 20, um, on .com it says 18, but 18 plus 4 doesn't equal 24. And so it goes off for 20 hours, comes back on the same exact time every single night. And all these little jewels, they're already on there for you. You may have purchased chandeliers in the past that you had to assemble. You do not have to assemble like this. Right out of the box. Right out of the box. You just open it up and hang it up. There, I love that shot right there because obviously we're outdoors. But, but in the daytime, those little faceted jewels mm -hmm. capture the light and it sparkles i love this on a front porch i like this if you have a little sitting area uh, as i said if you want to put it in a covered patio it's perfect for that it's even great like in a powder room yes. for a party yes for a wedding right yes. it's just it has this formal look it's look at the price it's 40 percent off at 24 dollars and 95 cents Battery operated, and I, it has a timer, correct? Yes, the four-hour timer. You should actually buy two, and I'm gonna, I already warned Rebecca. Look at how it's I, lighting I up right there. So yeah. sorry, Rebecca. Now, guys on one side of the table, I'm on the other. Just imagine for a second, yeah. I know there's a plant here, we, we're selling live plants. Over your table. But imagine hanging two above your dining table outside or above your outdoor patio furniture in any regard or inside, right. doesn't matter. They're battery operated. They do not need to be outside. Now, think about how much of a statement this is. If you have a wedding coming up, right? If you have a, a baby shower outside, any of those events, take a look at your screen. Now, the multicolor one is gone. So the clear, though, is what we buy the most of because it matches every decor. Um, but it doesn't matter how you hang it, only weighs a couple of pounds. It can be a nail, it can be a hook, it can yep. be a screw, it can be wherever you hang a potted plant from. It doesn't where you like your hanging baskets, I should say. But look, that's inside, yeah. guy. That's and by inside. the way, we have the hanging hooks available. And Sam will put that up. Sam's yeah, our producer this. today. Sam's gonna put that up. Look at that shot right there. Look at how pretty. You know, it just adds an elegance to your outdoor yes. space or indoor space. I mean, these are meant to be more indoors or in a covered area. But you know, if you've got a, a, an area where you get a little bit of coverage, you can put it there. So screen porch would be ideal. I love it if you've got an area of your house where you have your your indoor plants. Yes. It'd be pretty there as well. And I love the fact that it automatically turns on, automatically turns off every day. Now they are meant to be outside. I mean that because we have to uh, weather resist them, right? So they're meant to be outside, which sure. means you could put them in a bathroom right above your bathtub. Yeah. Imagine, do you have a soaking tub like where you take that bubble bath every night? Spoil yourself. Oh my gosh, you wanna talk about elevating this your atmosphere. It's great for a Valentine's present too, oh, right? Because yeah. they're, they're very romantic. You get this and you get some jasmine mm -hmm. flowers and you can float those jasmine flowers yeah. in your tub. If you've got any area of your home that you just wanna make a little more relaxed, a little more elegant, you can do it with this. That price is not gonna last. Chad and I had our meeting before and he said, 
This is it on this one. I didn't even know we were doing this right. price, number this one. This is they a didn't, closeout. They did not tell me, right. and we do not have a, this is really hard to make, that long story short, we are make, We are not making this again. <laughs> well, and, and sh when you get it out of the box, it's actually flat, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, so it's kind of like yeah, this. Yeah, exactly. Okay. It's not delicate. You don't have to worry no, about no, it. No, 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 mm no. -hmm. And then you just open it up. There's going to be uh, a plastic wrap around it to protect it, of course. You just open it up. It falls right into place. They sound like glass, but they're not. No, they're like a really hard acrylic. Yeah, they're acrylic. Mm -hmm. And so if it ever gets, um, let's say you, you do put it outside and the pollen comes and covers it in yeah. pollen, or you just hose it off. Just dust it off. It's not a big deal. You don't have to worry about this. You don't have to baby it. Every single jewel's on its own O-ring. If you just joined us, batteries are included. They're inside your box. Just open up the battery. Pop them right in the top. That's the only work you have to do. Smart timer. It stays on for four hours. It goes off for 20. So it comes on the same exact time every night like magic. You never have to worry about it. You, once you hang it up, even if it's really high, you don't have to get on a ladder and get back up there and turn it on and off every night. It does all the work by itself. By the way, that's a live shot. That's just the sun hitting it. So it's yeah. just as gorgeous in the yeah, day. Look. Here, let's, let's just give it a little movement. Sorry. Yeah. But that's Sorry the daytime. Look it, at how pretty that is. It's going to look as good <laughs> in the day as it does at night. Yeah. You see my big head in the shot? Yeah. Well, it's live TV. I wanted to show everybody. How, look how pretty that is. See how it sparkles? Oh, my gosh. All right. 40% off if you want to get it today. It's a customer pick on hsn.com. No brainer as far as I'm concerned. Um, want to remind you the roses are still available. All right. But very, very popular. The jasmine. How many left of the jasmine, Sam? What did we say? Four or 500? That's it. 250 left in jasmine. Dang, I'm gonna miss out on the jazz. All right, Chad is staying with us. Yeah. This is, you wanna talk about charming? I was just adjusting the set. Yeah, That's this, okay. we have, this, this is a plant stand that is made out of metal steel, meant to be outside, solar powered because there are twinkle lights that wrap around it's it. It's $35 off. Yeah, so. It's 60% off. Look, it's like a little, it's a little chair for your plant. It's like a little stage. Right, and a little welcome sign. So you're merely meant to put it by the door. This is a solar panel I'm sort of touching back here. You can adjust it up or down because surrounding, wrapped around all the metal, all the steel here um, is a twinkle light, like little fairy lights. So they're wrapped around and they come on at night. They're not too bright though. They're not distracting. They're not gonna like illuminate your porch. They're meant to be ambient lighting, very dim to give you that ambiance. And then you put your little plant there and this will actually swing in the wind, your little welcome sign if you have a lot of breeze, which is so great. Hopefully you can find a plant that sort of just, this is an interior design trick, that sort of gives you that green in front of the plant or behind and it will hold that sign exactly where you want it. This is the butterfly design, this butterfly here design at top. The one over here on my other side is the heart design. Right here yeah. next to me. So you're just choosing. This does come flat packed. Look it's at the very, heart. This is beautiful. Deb, look at the heart. Look at this heart. Look at how beautiful that is. And you know what I like? I like that it's very slight. Yes. Like it's it's not a big chunky no, thing. I'm you standing here this, next to it. You could put this, and by the way, those are those are one uh, one thing of the roses you're gonna get when you order the roses. And the item number is right over there in the corner. Yeah. But look at how pretty that is. So you could put this on an entryway. You could put this out on your deck. If you have a swimming pool and you wanna get a couple of them, I can't emphasize enough the discount. It's clearance. It was $65. It's under 30, it's $29.95. I'd get two, get one in the butterfly, get one in the heart. If you know somebody that loves butterflies or maybe you wanna get this for Valentine's. There's a lot of details right. that, there, that anybody who gets I is gonna appreciate. I love the welcome sign too, don't you? Yeah, and it's all metal. Like nothing here is plastic, nothing's cheap or wimpy in the terms of like stability and sturdiness of being no. outside. There's those little twinkle lights, you can see them, they just glow, and they're beautiful. And this is solar. Solar, right. And so even if you wanted to put this, I'm just gonna be realistic. If you wanted to put it in the dark, the shady area, Look don't worry. That. It is gorgeous without any lighting at all. Right. Now, there are people, uh, customers right. who- hold on, Chad. Look at that. That is gorgeous. Now imagine putting a little bucket there underneath where you can drop your shoes or your keys or your things by your door, right? Yeah. Or you keep the dog leash and the dog little poop bags there. At the no. You know, you have a dog. I've ordered a lot of those. Right. Amazon <laughs> is like making money off me off poop bags, that's so, for sure. So we you, don't carry them here, otherwise I'd buy them at HSN. <laughs> so you, you put this by your door and whether you're using it for a plant or just those grab and go things as you go out of the house or right yeah. by the front door that you can just take I'm with just you on your walk. Give you an idea, of the, I'll sit next, yeah. to, sit yeah. next yeah. to it so you see how big it is. So it's actually pretty substantial. Mm -hmm. It goes about two feet high. It's about yep. almost the same going left to right. Yep. I love the little decorative uh, base 
base on it. It's got a nice firm plant stand here that'll hold heavier plants. You don't have to worry about that. And then you have this adorable little welcome sign. Obviously, this says front porch all day, but you could you could use this if somebody just moved into a new home. Absolutely. And you want to get them something neat, yeah. right? It's 60% off. That's a great shot. Thank you, Rebecca. Look at it. Look at how, how beautiful that is. And it's a real subtle heart. It's got a little crest in the center and then some more filigree work. I love the little chain. I mean, there's been a lot of detail. Here's your solar panel down on the bottom, and it articulates so you can move it into the sun. And I agree with you. Yep. Whether, it, whether it glows or not, I, if you want this indoor, yep. like in, a, in an alcove or walkway, you could put it there as well. We got a little bug on the top. If you're a professional and you own a yeah. business and you want to put it in front of your business, you could do that too. Yeah, now if you want to put this in your bathroom again, any of our outdoor items Welcome are great to my for bathroom. inside, right? And you could, well, I say that because I saw a customer post a picture on Facebook, I believe. She yeah. had towels put in here. Oh, that's smart. And I thought, what yeah. a great little towel rack. That's, I never yeah. thought of that. And there's so, nothing wrong with being welcomed into the potty. I, you know I, what? That's right. Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> you can, just as oh. we're getting, you can remove this. There's, there's little, the butterfly. There's chat. little clips if you want to take yeah. off the welcome sign. The little clips are just on either side. So, so we can, are yeah. insanely busy right now. Please use express ordering. It's only $29.95. These are, you know what's nice about this too, Chad? I'll stand up so you don't have to keep squatting. Um, <laughs> These like are the little these are the little touches that make a house a home. Yes. Having little warm things like that. I'm not preaching like I'm a designer, but I you know, I take a lot of pride in my house. And on my front porch, I actually have this old antique. It's not an electric doorbell, it's a bell that you actually ring. Yeah. And it's a cardinal. And I found it like in some, I don't know, secondhand shop. Yeah. But I love it. Exactly. And it's, I've had it on my house since I moved, right? But it's little touches. And I yes. know when people come to my house, because people ring it. I'm like, the UPS guy's ringing my cardinal. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. But those little things are kind of what welcomes people into your environment, right? And for $29.95 on sale, 60% off, think about where you could put this. You could put it, it could be welcome into my garden. That's right, anything. Out in your yard. You could put it in your planters. You don't yeah. have to have it by your door by any means. Now, this is the heart design. I'm just going to slide this over Go just ahead. to make it easier. And we're running out of time. This is going to be your butterfly design. Here they are side by side. And so all you're doing is making the choice. If you have space for both, maybe pick up both because they're both beautiful. I'm going to step out of the way. The butterfly design is huge. It's right over the top here. And then the heart is right next to it. If you're a heart lover, if hearts mean something to you, that is a great little piece. But Guy pointed it out, whether you're gonna put it in the middle of your garden, it's gonna look great there because it's solar. It'll give you a little light because all the metal is wrapped in those twinkle lights, okay, all the way around. Or you wanna put it by your front door or even inside your house. Maybe it's the entry to your shed or your garage, so it's outside. You don't have to put a plant here by any means. Like, I'll take that plant away. It's a flat base. You could put anything you want right there, whether it's a bowl with your dog leash or your shoes or your keys or anything like that. You can absolutely do that. And it's going to come to you flat pack. You just open it up, put that shelf there. That's all you need to do. Solar panel on the edge. And so when that solar panel right here, you just flip it on. It comes on when it's dark. It goes off when it's light. It's no maintenance. It's easy to do. And at the end of the day, it's a metal piece of yeah. outdoor decor right. for less than 30 bucks. And you know what it reminds me of? Yeah. There, there's a couple of really cool little shops that are like, you know, little boutique art shops yep. in Sarasota. Uh -huh. So I go there once in a while. This is, looks like something you'd see there. Oh, this would be 100 bucks. And it would be 99 Yeah, bucks. exactly. You know it would be. <laughs> yes. It's $29.95. Yeah. Get some personality in your garden or, or in your entryway. Remember, this is made to be outdoors. But I agree with Chad. If you want to put it inside. Anywhere you want. Anywhere you want. Yeah. Butterfly or you have the heart shape. Mm -hmm. Either one. You could buy two for one today. Two, you'd have two for one and have change left over. There you go. With the discount that we I'll have. take the change. Thank you, my friend. <laughs> See you later, guys. Chad Allen, best guy. Thank you so much. Thanks. Seven, seven, four, one, nine, one, I think. I'll put this back. Guys. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Thanks, Appreciate everybody. You. Hey, by the way, where's the jasmine? Do I have to tell them the truth that there's only 200 left? Because I want one. I guess I have to tell you the truth. <laughs> I got 200 left. If you want jasmine, it's going to sell out. It's just a matter of time. Treat yourself. All right? You want something romantic? You want something? If you've never smelled jasmine before, you've probably smelled it in a perfume. Let me tell you this. Jasmine flower smells better than any perfume you will ever wear. Imagine perfuming your whole yard with one plant. It's powerful. It's intoxicating. It's gorgeous with this pristine white flowers. And you're getting a, a tree 
When you see the size of it, it's, the, the, the plant itself is half this size. It's this big. So you're ready to go. $24.95. All right. Where am I going? Oh, Deb, come on back out. Deb's going to join me. Deb, Deb, should we sit in our little chair? Is that okay? Oh, yes. You and I have been doing a lot of sitting lately. We have. Yeah. <laughs> Let's sit down again. Make sure that we're... Ooh, that's pretty dang comfortable. So Deb is my indoor-outdoor, uh, not only gardening, but, you know, because Deb brings us the fences, <clears throat> all the great faux flowers. You bring us so many wonderful things. This is a steal. And, you know, a lot of our customers out there, they, don't, they can't do a garden, right? They want color in their yard. They want something sweet and something pretty because they don't have a lot of time to do gardening. Well, that's exactly what this is. You're gonna add a, a pop of color or whimsy, and I don't get to use that word, or orb very often. Oh, yeah. We use the word orb and whimsy today. <laughs> um, and, you, and you get this beautiful little flower that's always in bloom. Now, this is solar, and it actually puts on a show during the day with its beautiful bright color, but at nighttime, the center of the flower comes to life and it illuminates. We are doing this today for $19.95. Samantha, we might have to stretch this because I have a feeling we are going to get even more busy than we already are. Uh, it stands about three feet tall. 36 inches, yep. And we have what, three colors? Three colors, two designs and three colors. But what I love for you guys is what we've always said is these work go right into the ground. There's a stake that'll put them in the ground. But when you're looking at the, the TV screen now, they light up. There are seven LED lights in the center of each one of these beautiful motifs. They are gorgeously, beautifully painted. The head is about nine and a half inches in diameter. This is going to give you that touch of whimsy. It's a solar panel that just gets charged the minute you put them outside. You can put them directly into the ground, but what I've always said is if you don't have a yard that's big, you can put them in a pot. And the backstage crew really did it because these were the pots that were available earlier in the nine o'clock yep. hour. Yeah. So you can go ahead and just fill a pot with flowers and soil and put your gorgeous flowers in here and have that wonderful, whimsical look if you've just got a balcony or maybe you've got a small lanai or tuck them among your real flowers. We've got three gorgeous colors. I'm here with that beautiful yellow. Yep. And it, you'll notice that mine is round. And then the other two gorgeous colors are more this spiky. Is blue. Yeah, this is That's blue. the blue. We're calling it blue multi because it's got orange flowers on the inside. And this is the purple. That's the purple with Look the fuchsia how, tips. Look at how but pretty. the lights at night, the late it's like, do you remember lightning bugs? Did they call them lightning bugs yeah. in Connecticut? Yep. Yeah. Yep. So it's like little fireflies. lightning bugs. Yeah, fireflies. Yeah. yeah. So it's little tiny LED lights that are going to pop up in the center as soon as the light goes down. So you've got something that's going to be adorable during the day with that great bright that great bright head of color and then at night you've got those little twinkly lights it's absolutely beautiful and I love them in these pots because it gives you all kinds of versatility to put them on a porch have them flank your front door put them inside if you want once they've been charged you can bring them in a little bit they're absolutely beautiful but they're weather resistant they're rust resistant they can get them now if it's cold up north and have a little bit of anticipation of spring is right around the corner because um, Poxitani Phil said it's yeah. Yeah. Gonna, okay, yeah, spring it's is coming. coming. It's Groundhog but these Day. These are year round. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. I put these adorable. out right now, get them into the ground. Doesn't matter, right? And then uh, Deb's showing you, she's taking her hand on and off. And you can see when they kind of, when the lights kind of pop on, it's bright out here, so it's tough to see. But if you're retired, if you're a senior, and you just want some color out on your patio, if you don't have a garden and you have a porch and you just want something colorful out there, it's ideal for that. If you want to put them out in your front yard and let the snow hit them because it's still cold, you can do that as well. The detail, all ha like hand-painted detail all over the flower face itself. Look at the little leaves and look at the, look at the attention to detail on the leaves. The solar panel is behind it and to be honest, you don't even notice it. No, you really don't. But you can move it up or down to get the sun. Yes. These are the kind of thing that you put up during the day and then you just can't wait for it to get dark. I know, it's, I know. I you know. keep picking your head out. Is it dark yet? Is it dark yet? I know. But what's wonderful about this is exactly what Guy is saying. If you're not a gardener or maybe you've just got a very small place or you just want that little something that's going to elevate your outdoor space, these are so whimsical and charming. I mean, 
mean, if you can do it, I would recommend getting a couple of them because they can flank. You could get a couple of pots like we've done here and have them flank your front door for that pop of color. But remember, they are all weather resistant and that color is going to maintain it for the years. minute you get them out there. Yeah. Absolutely rust resistant, weather resistant, absolutely gorgeous. And all you need to do is expose them to the sun and then those little lights will come on and you'll see how charming that is. So you've got something that's absolutely beautiful during the day with all that bright color and whimsy. And then at night, you've got all that charm. So they're just a win-win in your yard or garden, on your front yeah. porch or out on your lanai. You can tuck these, like if you have shrubs or trees and you don't have any flowers, you can pop these in between the yes. shrubs and the trees. Just make sure that that solar panel gets a little bit of sun during the day. And I agree with Deb. Even if they, you know, even if you want to tuck it in a place where it doesn't get sun, they're still pretty, and they still look wonderful yes. during the day. So if you want to put this on your porch, if you live in a condo or an apartment, like my mom, she's, you know, she's 91, and she's got herbs growing out there. Her and her caregiver mm -hmm. will grow herbs, but she doesn't have any. She doesn't have a lot of flowers because there's not a lot of sun. Of course. So you can do that. But it gives, you, it gives you something to look forward to. It gives you something to see in your yard when, you're, when you pull in to your driveway, right? It gives you that little something to look forward to every day. And for, for $19.95... It's crazy. It's a, that's oh, a ridiculous It's crazy. Bucks. Absolutely. Now, remember, too, there's three different designs. The round is the yellow multi, and that's beautiful. It's a round shape. And these are not spinners, by the way. So, I mean, spinners are really popular, but these are going to be stationary. The, the wonderful benefit is that they've got the lights inside, the seven LEDs. Then you've got the more spiky flowers, and those will be in the blue multi and the purple multi. So you have two styles and three great colors. 36 inches, they go right into a pot, or they'll go right directly into the ground. The stake is about four inches. The entire thing is 36 inches by nine and a half inches. Inches, but you can't go wrong with any one of these beautiful flowers. They're whimsical and charming, and at night they light, they're, so they're adorable. It's a 24-hour show. It, abso it absolutely That's is. That's what it is. So from day to night, you have something out there. I love it, especially like, you know, because it's daylight savings time, and a lot of you, when you get home, like I get home different times because of my schedule, but Danny always gets home at 6, and it's always dark. Yes. And it's like to have any kind of lighting in your yard, just it puts a smile on your face when you put in when you pull in wonderful always in bloom 24 hour display and when the sunshine hits them you'll see all the pop of color and then at night i like deb said like like lightning bugs and yeah. you know what's funny that's what we called them yeah. the grown ups called them fireflies yes yes kids yes. called them lightning bugs because that's what they look like they look like a just a group of little lightning bugs outside 20 bucks on sale marked down from 36.95 we are very busy um, if you want any of the colors, I've got about 250 left oh. in each color. That's oh, wow. it. Okay. So 750 total. But look at how beautiful, by the way, too, look at how beautiful they are in the pots. If you had purchased these pots with the flowers yeah. in them, the, the backstage crew went ahead and put these in here, which is always something look that I this. suggest that if you don't have a yard, you can have them yeah. on a balcony. And look at how charming they are. They're in there securely because the stake is about four inches long. The entire piece is 36 inches, but it's that little touch of whimsy, zero maintenance. Remember, all you need to do is expose them to the sun and they do all the work. They're beautiful during the day with the beautiful colors yeah. in it like that. Do you know, if you picked up a couple of items for our show today, because I want, stay on the shot right there. Look at this, what we made. Would you not mm -hmm. want that on your front porch? Oh, totally, totally. You have, you have the roses that we had earlier in the show. You have the pots that we had earlier in the show. And then you've got a beautiful, a beautiful little piece of artwork inside. How pretty would two of those be right on your front porch oh, when absolutely. people walk in? Absolutely. Right? Uh, that's just why I'm saying be your own designer. I'm telling you. Well, the backstage crew put that together for us and they are absolutely a winner. They're so charming. So remember, you can put them in the ground or you can do something like we awesome. did here. They're really amazing. All right, stick with me for a sec because we want to remind everybody, if you want the roses, remember you get six varieties of roses. Six growing plants will be delivered to your house. You don't get charged until they ship. For most of you, that's not going to be till March, April, or May. But you're getting your roses now before they sell out. I know we ordered about 10,000 of these. We're already down to about 8,000. They go really, really quickly. So if you want to get any of the plants or if you want to get any of the stuff, as I said earlier, the early bird gets the worm, right? 
Absolutely. I love it. Hey, really quickly, I want to remind you about our when to watch emails. These are brilliant because you can be the first to know when your favorite brands are going to be on air. You can customize your shopping experience by signing up for when to watch emails. Uh, why do that? Well, it saves you time because you're the first one to know when your favorite brands are going to be presented live on air. Um, also, it's fun to customize your shopping experience by choosing the brands you love to shop the most. Um, shop your favorite brands. Be the first to get in on their best and brightest buys. They're called When to Watch Emails. Make sure you sign up. All right, what are we doing? Are we taking a break? Man, this, these garden shows go by quick. I'm going to sit back and enjoy all the lovely flowers. When we come back, we've got my big pick of the show, my sun show, Garden Power Sprayer. That's coming up next. I don't have all day to give you a neck massage, so why don't you try this Hometics Airflex Pad? It has three air chambers inside that inflate and deflate to stretch out your neck. Just lay down and relax on your bed or on a sofa and use the handy remote to customize your stretch. You can choose from deep stretch, soothe and relax, or energize. It pushes into the muscles to give you that deep stretch. Holds you gently and then releases. Oh yeah. Do you want to try it? Uh, yes. Okay, come here. Everything that you just said mm -hmm. combined with the heat is gonna give you that like next level relief. Ah, oh, yes. Stop feeling obligated to rub somebody else's neck and shoulders. Get yourself a Hometics Airflex Pad. So if you would like your own relief at home, you can get yours by using the item number at hsn.com or the app, or you can also use that QR code that's right on the screen. HSN is celebrating Black History Month. All of February, we're highlighting Black-owned and founded businesses. Discover a specially curated assortment of brands and products that celebrate the Black experience and feeling beautiful in the skin that you're in. It's an inclusive celebration with exclusive collections. All month long on HSN and HSN.com. There's so much to celebrate. All right, welcome back. So this is my big pick of the hour. And I'll tell you out there, if you're a do-it-yourselfer, you gotta jump on this. I got this, might have been a year or two ago when I bought mine. And what it does is it takes your regular garden hose and it amps up the pressure. It's not a pressure washer per se, it's a power washer. So the average garden hose is what, Bobby, what, like maybe 30 PSI for your garden hose? 40, 40 maybe if you put your thumb over it. This is gonna multiply that pressure five, six, seven times so that now you can wash the car, you can clean off the patio, you can clean off your pavers, you can wash your windows. You can do all that and you can do it convenient and easy. It connects directly to your garden hose, very simply, but there's no electric, all right? It has a built-in 24 volt rechargeable power supply. We're giving you the battery. That's a $50 value, the battery itself is $50, and you're getting the power sprayer to go along with it. So you can ramp up that PSI, driveways, decks, car wash, water your plants, totally portable without cords, and here's the best part, and I've used it this way. You could actually take, there's a siphon attachment, so take the garden hose off, there's a siphon attachment, which you can put in a five gallon bucket of water, so if you don't have access to a hose, you can wash using your bucket of water. Or you can put it in your swimming pool to clean off the deck of the pool. You can bring it to the beach, clean off the kids' feet. You can do all those different things, and we are doing it. Look at our price. It was, not, it was 100 bucks. It's $49. It's 50% off. Bobby Milliken, come on out. Outdoor expert, specialist, all things right. super cool. Yes, I got the red memo. And Thank yes, you. you did. Yep, we're, we're wearing uh, red for uh, you know to, uh, for awareness of heart disease for, yeah. for the ladies out there. Absolutely. Here's what I love about mine: no cords. You have no. a jacked up 24 volt battery. Right in here. And this is going to take the pressure from your regular garden hose 
yeah. and send it through the roof. Exactly, like you said, normally you'd only get 40 or 50 out of just a regular garden hose. I've got mine hooked up here. This is a power sprayer. And look at that, all that mud I was able to get easily and quickly. It was no match for this. I'll do another uh, path to clean right there for you. This is coming out at over 300 PSI. If you're not yeah. familiar with that, it's just pressure. It's just the number of pressure. Like the higher, eight to 10 the, times more than your garden hose. Way more than your garden yeah. hose. So what you're actually getting today, and it's so bright, I have no idea what camera's on us, but That's the point okay. is this. You're getting almost two in one, because on the one hand, it's almost like a mini pressure washer, right? right. On the other hand, I'm gonna show you at the second half of the presentation how it's portable. You don't even need a hose. I'm gonna get into that in a second. Well, not everybody needs a pressure washer. And yeah. They just you, want powered water to clean. Right, so yeah. right now I've got it hooked up to the hose. So if you've got outdoor patio, of furniture that sits out there. Of course, it's that's what it's supposed to do, sit out there in the cold and the rain, the snow. It gets wet, it gets mildew, it gets dirt, it gets debris. So it's nice to have something like this at your disposal that's quick and easy. You plug your hose into it and you don't have to be powered by any type of cord or extension cord. Why? because it's all right here, ladies and gentlemen. The battery fits inside here. I'll just kind of pop the hood. Not sure if the camera can get a shot, but the yeah. battery's inside. There. Hey, so Sam, show us, show the battery. The on battery it? on hsn.com, just the battery, is $50. It's like you're getting the pressure washer for free, the power washer for free. Yeah, pretty and, it's a no-brainer, right? Right, it's absolutely. And by the way, Sun Joe makes the best batteries of any of the batteries that, that we carry here. They're fantastic. I've got three or four items from Sun Joe that I love. My well, little chainsaw, my little cutters. I've got so many different things. I love this company. That's the great yeah. point about it is because our battery is interchangeable. It works in over 100 of our other Snow Joe and Sun Joe items. And I'm just going to hold this still for a second and kind of go through the nozzles. Yeah, because you, you get this multi-spray uh, uh, lance. Yeah, I love it because with our pressure washers, listen, we sell those all day, but the nozzles you have to replace, replace. This is built in. You've got five of them. You have a 25 degree fan right there. You've got a zero degree, laser. which is like a laser. You've got a zero plus, which is uh, very strong as well. You've got a nice like flowering one right there. Then you've got a 40 degree, that's great for decks and driveways, and a 25 right there. Actually, the 40 I would use on your car, the 25 I would use on the 25 floor. 25 is the most powerful. Yeah, let yep. me come over here to the welcome mat. The, I don't know if the jib's out here, but we can take a look. It looks like it might be okay looking until you get the Sun Joe power sprayer on it and you can actually see the true blue colors coming out. And keep in mind, if you're just tuning in, you're like, Sun Joe, who the heck is Sun Joe? Well, we've been around for 15 years. We're actually happy to celebrate our five-year anniversary right here with you at HSN. So we've been around, we've got a lot of great products, and of course, we've got a great, great warranty. I mean, look at the before and after of that welcome mat guy. All that power built in, and yes, you can use the hose, but after break, I'm gonna go over there and show you how you can use the siphon hose that we give you. Yeah. No extra purchase. You know what a lot of people buy this? It's much easier to handle than a pressure washer, okay? Exactly. I mean, if you look at the size of it, and it only weighs seven, six pounds, six, six seven and a half, seven pounds. So it's it's about a, a, maybe a quarter of the of the weight, and it's not clumsy like a pressure washer. And plus, what a lot of people are, it's a pressure washer is too much for them. Right. I love this for my customer because I'm like, it's easy to handle. You've got that water on demand, right? Anytime that you need it, you can clean anything you want. If you just bought it to wash your car or to clean off your pavers, or to wash your patio, or to clean off the pool. I mean, all that stuff. And look at the power of this thing. And it's, and it's on-demand water supply. So you're not using up a lot of water when you wash your car. And you, you notice how convenient it is. And you can see how much water I'm spraying here. As soon as I turn it off, it cuts the power and there's no drip. That's the quality of Sun Joe, which is why they stand by their products with a great warranty. So I mentioned before, if you just buy it to wash your car, it's perfect for that. Bobby's over on, on, his, on our little uh, SUV over there, and he's going to show you how you can use the different, uh, the different lances and the different adjustments to clean your entire vehicle. You are out and about, maybe you're boating, maybe you're camping, maybe you're RVing, and you don't have access to power or need corded. This is great because not only we give you the unit, we give you the battery, it's 24 volt, rechargeable, no fade power. We give you the siphon hose. All you need is some fresh water. I got a five gallon bucket, the water's in here. I've got the water source just from this 20 feet. By the way, 20 feet of siphon hose. You hit the safety, I know you're asking, how do you work it? Hold the safety, push the button, and then look at this. Now. You've got your own at-home car wash Look at that. without ever having to be plugged into anything. Even if you don't have the hose or want to get the hose out and hooked up, you can still do it. Now, God, did you, did you tell me you also get this the brush, the too? This is the best part. <laughs> you also get the utility watch this. brush. So you see how easily I pop that on? Now if you've got that layer of pollen or you've got those love bugs on the front, 
or the, your headlights right there, or maybe you wanna get down here and get in between that dirt and that grime, or that grease in between your wheels, all you do is pop this on and off like that, it's that simple. And again, we give you the brush. It's not an extra purchase or anything. You snap that on, and then look, you're off to the races. I talked about if you're camping, you got coolers out there, clean off the dirt and debris off them. If you've got little kids like me, I've got two of those little gremlins at home. Their stuff gets so dirty so quickly, especially the bikes. My little son, Bo, is getting into biking and possibly motorbiking, so everything is gets dirty and muddy. Well, now, without having to have a big pressure washer, without pulling out a big, bulky unit, you have the ability to clean, and clean quickly and fast. By the way, numbers-wise, guy, when you're hooked up to the siphon hose, you're getting 275 PSI. When you're hooked up to the garden hose, you're getting 300 and 20 PSI. All of that, not from corded power, all of that from the battery that is included with your purchase. What do you think, guy? <laughs> Crazy or what? Dude, <laughs> I just stepped out of the sun because it's like, it's like- Oh, you're fine. We're like standing on the surface of the sun over here. So here's what I'll tell you. I don't have a lot of these to go around. Obviously, it's a clearance sale price. I own it, I love it, okay? I use this way more than I use my pressure washer. And by the way, you really shouldn't use a pressure washer on a car or vehicle anyway, because your chances of scrub, messing up the paint yeah. is what it is. This has much, much more like regular day-to-day -day applications, and you don't have to worry about plugging in a pressure washer. This is, this is completely cordless, okay? We've attached our garden hose to it, just like that. It's lightweight, it's comfortable in your hand. I love this, Bobby, for our customer, because our customer, a lot of them can't handle a pressure washer. Yeah. But they own a vehicle, they have they have outdoor patio furniture, they have a grill, it got, they, they want to be able to clean, your mind? Yeah, I was just gonna say, while you do that, I'll grab, I'm behind here to the right. Look, we sell these all day long, right? And these are great. We're, listen, we're the number one brand of pressure washers in the United States, but maybe you don't want to spend a lot more money on this item. Maybe this is a little bit too big and bulky for you. Maybe you don't want to switch each and every one of the nozzles. Maybe you don't want to be, have to be plugged in to the wall. Maybe you just want something lighter weight, less expensive, and a little bit easier to handle, and that is where this power sprayer really shines. Yeah. Because it's less expensive, because it's lightweight, because yeah. you can get over 300 Done. PSI, to me, guy, it's a no-brainer because you've got all this power at your fingertips, right? Oh, my gosh, yeah. And, and by the way, again, it's only about six, seven pounds. Easy to handle, one-handed. I mean, listen, if, you, if you're just a, a weekend warrior and you like to wash the car, get this, Done. all right? <laughs> having that scrub brush on there, that, that like, and, and having that thrown in at half price. It's neat to have a, a, a well, wand because, that you can use. Yeah, but not having, especially here in Florida, like you said, when, you, when we get the little bugs on the car. Yeah, get those off your... You can cut your wheels, the, yeah, the brake Your dust. golf carts, your yes. ATVs, your motorcycles, all the fun toys that. that you like to have at home. And when your neighbors see you, they're going to be like, is that a pressure washer? And you're going to be like, no, it's a power washer. They're going to be like, what's where's, where's the plug? Where's the plug? Yeah, where, how are you getting that power? And you're like, I don't need it. So you could take this camping, boating, if you're a fisherman, right? You want to rinse off the boat and you don't have a water source, use Perfect. the ocean. Perfect example, exactly. <laughs> rinse it off or, or whatever. I mean, you literally can use any water source. If you, uh, if you take this in the summer to the beach, fill up a bucket of water and you can yep. rinse the kid's feet off, right? Exactly. You can do all those things. You could rinse off your pets because a pressure washer, you wouldn't do that. Too no, strong. Too much. But how many of you out there put your thumb over the end of the garden hose to get pressure. <laughs> I used to do that, old school. You know what that does? It takes the pressure from 30 to 60. This is 300 PSI. Yeah. 10 times that amount. And you're not putting your thumb over anything. Easier on the hands. And I love the grip, the grip is easy. Yeah. Look at this, outdoor it's, furniture. It's got a nice ergonomically designed grip. You would never think that I'd be able to get this outdoor patio cushion clean with just something that is powered off battery, not a full-on pressure washer, but again, a power sprayer. That's why, guy, I say this is the perfect in-between. It's way more powerful than your garden hose, but not as big and bulky and expensive and or powerful as a pressure washer. And again, we love the pressure washers, but not always do you need that much power. You see how quickly and easily I got this, and if you know anything about patio furniture, you know these are not cheap, yeah, right? right? What about the fence? Mold, mildew, all that dirt. This stuff, usually you would either have to pre-treat with soap, 
or put some bleach on it. And just with the power of pressurized water, and again, I'm using the hose, so I'm getting about 300, 320 PSI. But I didn't even use the utility brush on this. Look at the whole top here. panel of that guy. Would you Com show everybody how to switch it out real Compare quick if yeah. I hand you that? Yeah, you pop this out here. I'll give you that one. And then you just put so this. So watch now, if you wanna, because if you see, those shingles over there are really dirty. So if you wanna add a little scrub brush to your, to your pressurized water, yeah. watch how this cleans. This is awesome. Yeah. You can just kind of do that and yeah. use the brush. I've never used it over here, Guy, but that's a good idea. Yeah. See how the water still comes out? So you get the power of the pressure water and the scrubbing of the utility brush, just like that. This has got, boy, the guy's put a lot of dirt on this. Hey, but Bobby, there, it's still coming off pretty good. Yeah. And if I had a, if I wanted to put it in a five gallon bucket of water, yeah. I could put soap in there. Absolutely. And I could draw the soapy water Absolutely. out of the bucket. So if you're washing your car, get a five gallon bucket, Right? You can use that yeah. for your soap and then just pop it into the garden hose when you want to rinse. Absolutely. Then it's, you've already taken two steps yeah. in one. And don't forget, all these nozzles are built in at the end, so you don't have to get any accessories. You don't have to lose any nozzles. By the way, look how water? powerful this one is. Yeah. Pest nest, right? If you got oh, pest yeah, nest up yeah, here, yeah. boom, you want to get those hey, bees' get, nests. You have boom. to crack in the sidewalk. Watch oh, yeah. this. We'll get if, a close up. If you've got weeds, Watch. look at that. The mud coming right up. And I'm three or four feet away from that. Boom, or right here in between the cracks. Look at that guy. This is with that laser. Yeah. So I love the fact that you're not locked into just one spray. Bobby, water the plants right here to oh. my right. Oh, there we go. Look at this. Now we got a water in. <laughs> so how, what other tool has this many it <laughs> things doesn't... built into one? You want to water your plants? Great. You want to hose off your dogs, your kids? Great. You want to do a free car wash at home? Great. You want to step it up and use the 25 and really get some stuff clean like these uh, patio pavers? Great. You can do all of that without ever having to be plugged into anything. Why? Because you're using the Sunjo 24 volt lithium ion battery, rechargeable, no fade power, works in over 100 of our other items, and you're good to go. 50% off. I love that. That's, that's probably the best thing about it. You are getting 50. it cheaper than I got it for, okay? 50% off $49.95. Try it for 30 days. I know you're going to love it. You're going to use it year round. Thank you, my friend. Absolutely. Enjoy good it, guys. To see you. Thank Appreciate you. it. Nice work. All right. Hey, by the way, if you want our, our, uh, our little globe lights, you know, our flicker flame, Solar lights that you can pop in your pool. Um, Samantha, my wonderful producer, tells me there's still a few left. We'll show you the, oh, you're talking about the, I thought we were doing the globe lights. You're talking about our patio lights. My favorite lights. Oh, that's okay. There they are. Those are still available if you want to pick them up. Those aren't $14.95, but they're worth $44.95 because you get four of them. Um, anyway, grab them while you can. Uh, those are the ones in the pool. Look at how beautiful those are. You get two for $14.95. Recharge, recharged by the sun. Over a thousand people picked them up. So we're down to the last quantities on clearance. Look at the price difference, $14.95, half price. Okay. We are, we are down to our last item in the show. I get to work with one of my favorite buddies of all time, Mr. Peter Kilcullen, outdoor expert. Pete always brings in great things. Peter's been here. Well, heck, Peter and I have known each other. How many years, Pete? Longer than I've been here. Since we were born, I think. That's what it feels like. No, I think we met here. All right. So we're good friends. We raised our kids together. We've That's been around true. a long time. And both of us, we all both, what? I'm sorry. It's Harry's birthday today. You is it Harry's yeah, birthday? He's your your son Harry. Yeah. Happy birthday, Harry. <laughs> Peter is a, is a specialist, especially when it comes to uh, like lawn tools and stuff like that. He knows where it's at. He does a lot of gardening himself like I do. I bought this the first time it aired. We have, we have one that's taller, and, and then, or we have one that's smaller. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we have this one. This is right. the original. Yep. I don't care what kind of soil that you have in your yard. I lived in Arizona. We had clay and rock. Yep. Brutal. Florida's not much better because we get the root systems from the trees. I had a banyan tree with roots that are two inches around. This shovel will go through anything. We wanted to put it in the show now, too, because if you need to chip ice off your it's driveway. A yeah. This is a weapon. It's amazing. <laughs> it is $39.95. You will have this shovel the rest of your life. Absolutely. Because it's industrial made. Oh, yeah. Peter's going to show you all the different features. But I got to tell you, this thing is a beast. It's, it's super heavy duty, but what I love about this, you're holding that. This weighs just four pounds, or just over four pounds, which I think is amazing. But 
it just you bought it right away, you said. Oh, yeah, yeah, and, yeah. And I know why. It's because you've used the shovel before. If you've gone out and you said, I just have to maybe transplant or I have to clear an area. You know what I did recently was, was trenching out an area for an irrigation system. And you start doing it, and the digging is usually okay. But then you come across the roots. And I don't care where you are on the lawn, anywhere, you, you're nowhere near trees, and you're not near plants, there's roots underground, and it makes digging impossible. Well, that's why the root assassin was designed because it's basically two in one you have an amazing shovel but then you also have this serrated edge so you basically have a saw look at that on both sides these teeth you know what you, you called it um you called it like an alleygator like head because what's so amazing the is teeth that teeth look like alligators. yeah so teeth. you've got the teeth yeah. and then you've got the arrow design on it so it's getting into that hard soil easier than ever before and then it's cutting roots and here's the cool thing double layered the serrated edge these the teeth so they're cutting as you go in and yeah. on the way out. Yep. So they thought of everything. So this is why it's the root assassin. It's taking care of the most difficult part of any digging you're they doing in the yard. They literally look like shark's teeth. Yeah. When you look at shark's teeth, that's what they look like, and they're angled as well. So you are getting through any kind of a root. I use them to pry boulders out of the yard. Exactly. I've got, I mean, I've got the new dog, and she has made a mess out back. <laughs> so I've been filling in and cutting through the roots. Let me just say, it's the, it's, the, it's the best shovel you will ever buy. And I don't care what kind of soil you have, mulch, a hard roots, it doesn't matter, gravel. I've, I've had my shovel for probably two years when it first came out. I think it might have come out either 23 or 22. Yep, yep. It's the best shovel I own. And it looks exactly the same. And I beat that thing up. Yeah, the carbon steel, it's designed to do this heavy duty work. But most importantly, what you're seeing right here, this is the problem with digging anywhere in your yard are those roots. Sometimes it's just that, that snarl and mess of all those smaller roots. Sometimes it's the bigger roots. You know, and maybe you're like me, if you're doing that irrigation channel, you're down there, you have to dig out or, or cut those roots with a handsaw. Here, you're able to use that root assassin going in both directions when you're using this. It's going in the ground that arrowhead yeah. design lets it go in further it's got that folded over steel on top so you can get that leverage you can get two hands on that handle as you go down into the ground so again it just works better than the shovel you see right now yeah. guys over there digging i'm now, trying and this, this, the soil So here I was in that soil like earlier. Because what's happening over there is that soil is crisscrossed probably hundreds of times with all the roots around some of this. Is this bamboo or some of the palm? Yeah. It's, it's amazing, but it does a really probably good job. You can't see what I'm doing, but it's okay. It's, it's a. And <laughs> it's like a saw. You can use it that way. I'm Whoa. not gonna take this down, but you I want everybody did. to see. <laughs> Look at that. How close, you guys gotta get closer, otherwise, I'm just killing a tree. It, no, but I want people to see that's the sawtooth action. These things, this is bamboo. This stuff will grow back in a week. Trust you, me, you don't worry about starting. You can do that on the smaller limbs and things oh, yeah. up ahead. Because what's happening it's like is... a saw and a shovel. It's two in one. It absolutely is both. You're going to use this for those areas where you're trying to clear a new area. And maybe right. this is the time you're doing that. We're coming out of winter into the spring. You want to be able to clear out those areas. You want to be able to start replanting. But the problem is clearing that soil. And when you have roots, you are going to love this. That is all the difference, the way this cuts through the roots without having to have another tool, without having to have a handsaw. Yeah. It is a saw and it is a shovel. You know who loves this? People that go camping, have this in your have this in, our, in your RV, take it with you, you know, if you're pitching tents, whatever yeah. you need to do, you're gonna have the, the, the right tool for the job. Go to hsn.com right now and read the reviews. Have you checked out the reviews? I have. Almost every review is five star, all right? I think the last time I checked it was like 11 out of 12, perfect five star reviews because it's a tool that works. And not only that, whenever you have a shovel with a wooden handle, nine out of 10 times that's gonna last you one season. It's gonna break. Well, cause you're trying right to away. use it to pry, to pry up stumps up. and plants yeah. and roots. Because here's the thing, I think this is what everybody loves. And this is why you're gonna love the Root Assassin when you get it home. You have a shovel, you're gonna get a new one that does a better job. It's designed better, it's a completely new design. So when you have something that works better like this, that solves that problem that you have when you're digging in your own yard, when you're transplanting, when you're replanting, it, it really is amazing. The whole, everything they've designed, look at this, I, wanted, I didn't point this out earlier. You can see the, the very tip on that, see what's rounded. So not only can you cut through, and, and again, this is gonna be impossible to see, but you can see it's, it's shaved down, almost sharpened across the tip here. So you can break those branches and those roots as you go down into the soil, then you're cutting with the side. You've got a little scooped in design in the middle right here. All of this designed perfectly. And I mentioned this a second ago, that it has, here you can see standing on the back of that shovel so you get that additional leverage to push it down further. 
And it's just, it really is a completely different shovel, but it solves so many problems. All right, I, I, you know, and, and what I love about this, about, uh, about the Root Assassin as well, it's well made. I mean, I have gone through so many shovels. You know, you see shovels that you buy at the home store for right. 25 bucks, and it's got two screws, and it's made of wood, and the handle. You get splinters, it doesn't last. This is a lifetime warranty on this shovel. A lifetime warranty. It, it's Who amazing. Who does that on a shovel? <laughs> well, when you, when you design a shovel this good, and here's the thing about a lot of these shovels that you might be using right now to dig in your yard, to do some of that transplanting, those Man. shovels are meant to take, let's say, a pile of dirt and right. put it, that into your wheelbarrow, maybe. That's what it's designed to right. do. It's, it's not designed to dig. It's not designed to make a trench. It's not designed to remove plants and roots and anything. stumps. Right. It's, this is designed for what you're doing when you're at home doing your work around the yard. So the design is just amazing. Very strong, as you said. You're going to have it forever. When well, you see the carbon steel, when you see the great handle, it's rubberized, and you have that poly on the sides. It, it make, it, everything about it makes sense. It really if does. You come, if you come to the head of the shovel, and I want to show again, first of all, you have these shark's teeth on either side, okay, right here. You got to even be careful running your finger out. It's very, very, very sharp, but they're heavy-duty tines. I'm going to hold it on an angle so you can sort of see how heavy-duty those teeth are. And they're, and they're, so it's serrated going across. And then it's sharp all around the tip as well. So... And now this is, the serration is important because you're gonna get through, it doesn't matter what it is. It could be heavy duty roots. I got a big, you know that big banyan tree in my backyard? Sure, yeah. Dude, the roots are like two inches wide. Exactly. And my dang dog keeps digging up the roots. <laughs> so I gotta go out there and cut them. But here's the thing, if you wanna test a really good shovel, do this. If, you cut, if your shovel doesn't stick in the ground, it's not a good shovel. Well, it's, this shovel is so sharp and so that's heavy the design, weight. right? That's the design, that I mean, arrowhead design, or that, that that alligator design that you're talking yeah. about. And then those teeth. I thought this was really neat that they're they yeah, call it double layered because they're layered and then sharpened on both sides. So after you cut into the ground, right, you're going to stab into the ground. You can cut those roots, but now as you draw back and forth, you're cutting in both directions. So those big banyan roots, whatever it might be, you are able to get through them without a problem. I mean, this is I think such a an amazing change with whatever you're doing. Doing right now if you're using that shovel that's only meant to move dirt and it's maybe meant to move your mulch things like that now you have a shovel that is designed to attack those roots to remove those plants and stumps and it really does an unbelievable job all right I'm gonna, okay, I'm you're trimming. intent on cutting down that tree I'm not gonna do the whole tree I'm just gonna show you that this thing saws okay so you can see I'm sawing right through that that's just a dead branch but I sawed through that sucker and get the thing off. There you go. <laughs> so you can saw. <laughs> you did it. I mean, honestly, this is, <laughs> if you got somebody that's on your property and you want them to run away, just walk out with this in your hand. Yeah, and, <laughs> and you actually, you were talking about that. I think this is the actual, the perfect design. This is the 48 inch that we were talking about. Not too so tall, again, not too short. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So it's in the right spot. So you're getting that leverage. And I talked about, this is to me is the most important where you have that little fold over in the middle so you can get on top, get more leverage into that uh, difficult soil. Yep. And then two hands on the handle, but and, it's amazing. Dude, for planting. See, you gotta have it. You need, the shape of it is meant for planting, all right? Not, not only cutting, but so if you need to plant, pot, you know, your potted plants, it's, it's perfect because it comes, it comes almost to a point. So you can make that perfect circle, and then you That's can right. scoop all this stuff out. And I don't care if there's rocks or roots, it goes right through it. $39.95, not a bad investment for a shovel that you will have the rest of your life, and you will. I Lifetime like it. Lifetime warranty on this. Almost every review is perfect five star. Peter? It's great it's to see you, time. sir, yeah. Nice to see you looking Thanks. good, fit, all good. Thanks. All right, in case you missed it, I got a couple things I want to show you real quick. Uh, then we're in the show. Very, very popular. This is our Sunjo portable 24-volt cordless sprayer. So your garden nose right now is about 30 PSI. If you add this to it, you can crank it up to 300 PSI. You get that sprayer, which has five different options on the sprayer, okay? All you do is connect it to your garden hose. No electricity because it's got a 24 volt battery built into the handle, all right? The battery by itself is $50 if you buy it separately. We're offering the battery plus the sprayer with the scrub brush attachment for $49.95. So our price is normally $99. We, drop, we chopped the price in half. Very popular in the show if you wanna pick it up. Get it for $49.95. Here it is right here. And remember, 
You don't have to just put a garden hose. You can put the siphon, which comes with it, right into a bucket of water. And now I can use this, and I don't even have the garden hose attachment on. I'm sucking the water out of the, right out of the bucket. Look at that. No garden hose. There it is. If I want to water my plants, especially the one I just almost killed, I could do that as well. You're not wasting water. As soon as you turn it off, it automatically turns off. As soon as you stop squeezing the trigger. Trigger. Battery compartment is down here below. You're getting a 24 volt battery that is built into this, and you'll probably get about 30 minutes of runtime, maybe longer, 30 to 40 minutes of runtime, which is plenty to get out there and clean off your car, wash off your lawnmower, do your dry, you know, clean off your driveway, whatever it is that you need to do, you can clean off. $12.50 gets it home. It's the best deal I've ever seen on it. I told you before, I own this. I got mine for $60 with my discount. You're going to get it for $49.95. Get it home. If you just use it to wash the car, I'm telling you, you'll absolutely love it. Love this thing. All right, put it back on its little hook. There we go. So thank you for watching my show. Um, I want to tell everybody, first of all, I'm on vacation. I won't be back for a couple of weeks, uh, but please join us on Guys in the Garden. Now that's clever. I think Ty and, and um, Emily are going to be filling in for me, and I love that they're going to do that for me. So keep watching. I love you, Facebook friends. I will miss you, but I'll see you in a couple of weeks. The winner of our $25 gift card on what is it that you hate most about winter and can't wait to be over goes to Thomas, Thomas H. He says, the least thing I like about winter is shoveling. Who doesn't? Brett, you like to shovel? Shoveling sucks. All right, Natasha's up next, and she's got our best value of the day. Thanks for shopping with me. I'll see you in a couple weeks.